leave today. I want to leave today immediately. It says we're leaving today. Oh, okay. And now we're here. We've left today and we're here in tomorrow. In a world of fantasy. And yesterday. And yesterday, don't forget that, yes. Uh, life is good again. What is going on? I saw a sign out there. Did you see what that sign said? Uh, chalk walk is this weekend. Oh, chalk walk, okay. Yeah, they were just saying, uh, park opens earlier than normal. Which it's is probably uh, why it's so backed up out there. Yeah, yeah, okay, because it was really backed up out there. Yeah, it probably only just opened at night. Oh, so we kind of we delayed for a good reason then. Because it took us forever to get in here. On Rishi and Run Weekends, whether it's Chalk Walk or Run Disney, they open right. at least an hour later than normal. Sometimes. Da -da 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 -da. There's Daisy. Memories are happening today for so many people, including these muffins right here. Hi guys. Just taking a picture of those folks we just saw in the video and and then another family came up and <laughs> one of their daughters, she saw that we were getting a picture taken. She comes running out of the Emporium, screaming. <laughs> That's the cutest damn thing. I love you guys so much. When you guys come running out of the Emporium, screaming at us like that. Uh, <laughs> That's fantastic. They, they're up that away somewhere now, but they were so cute. Little kids showing us their new backpacks. They got the Lion Guard backpacks. Oh, there they are, way up there. Anyway, good morning, fresh baked and stuff. I figured We're it out. We're complaining about ducktails. It's very important over here. So, du okay, ducktails. So, I duck somebody said the the, the 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 boys never had they never duck had accents. Okay, well we they, just they also had, oh, oh, just we're they had wacky voices before slightly, but they also had no distinct personality. They, you could have interchanged any one of them. And they were kind of twins. They were, they were always they were triplets, but you could have swapped them out and it would have made no difference. But these three definitely have personalities. Yeah. There's a smart one so and a. So there's one who's laid back and doesn't care. Laid, there's yeah. one who's over eager and yeah. one that's always too, wants to be super prepared. See, so it's right, a right. junior woodchuck guy. Yeah. Right? What? Oh, Are you trying to motion us? Yeah. But my <laughs> question is. Did they have at least some semblance of a duck accent? They don't have to sound like Donald. But please, you can actually understand them this way. No, they sound like regular human beings. They, they always did. Nothing like that. Oh, no. They always did. No, before, they did have some semblance of quack to them. It was quack. No, okay. no, they was, have Right, no, I'm de definitely now, no, it definitely. It high-pitched Donald Duck. Okay, but we have a point. What's that? You kind of can't understand Donald. Um, That's always been the case, but though. That, you, you should not understand Donald. But for the point of a new TV show, there's tons of new generations that we're trying to like introduce this show to. If they can't understand four ducks on a show, do you really the, think they're going to the tune in? the main characters, and you want to give them personalities. Like, are they really going to tune in Wait, for that long? Uh, Why does Donald have custody of these nephews? Because, because we, honey, we looked this up like months ago. Okay. Someone, Who died? Someone died, yes. <laughs> okay, you, you notice at the end there, he was all, Mom? You remember that? Yeah. Okay, so we're probably going to find out what happened to their parents. Oh, okay. Because right? I forgot. Well, we're going to find out. They, there, no, there was no story before. There wasn't. That they were just, nephews, just nephews, Donald looked after Uncle them. Because I was trying to figure out why was he just so willing to say, hey, you know what, Scrooge, have these kids. Media. Yeah, family's family, bro. Right, but for me, I, I always, like, I know it's wrong, but I always think of them as his kids, like, they lived with him. Part of the reason Donald left behind in the old show was that he went off to the Navy. He went and joined the Navy, so Scrooge watched him. Oh, okay. Kids. Oh, Alright. I didn't yeah. know that. I didn't know that part either. Okay. Hey, um, meanwhile. Also, don't tell Scrooge McDuck that he used to be something because he will pop off on you and show you how wrong you are. I like Scrooge McDuck. I'm not a husband. I'm not a Like, he got all salty when they said that to him. Are like, we going to see the other 
second richest Scottish duck? Oh, Gromboat again? Yeah. Probably, yeah. He was, he was a recurring character. <laughs> okay. There were also references to the other Disney afternoon shows like Spoonerville from Goo Troop, St. Canard from Darkwing Duck, oh my God. And Look at it. Cape Suzette from Tailspin. Lynn's Tailspin's character so hasn't showed up yet, right? No, Gizmo Duck, when, when Gizmo Duck has not shown up yet. I thought it was something else. No, he was voicing Gizmo. No, uh, and that's not what it says on the internet. I they mean, called him like Fenton. Well, that's the actual character's name. His his like robot superhero persona is Gizmo. Oh. So they're from. Let's go, folks. Let's go. Rides down Main Street. You want to go back down Main Street, David? I was thinking about it. I know. You I want to ride the fire truck, but that, that's Walt Disney's favorite vehicle. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, let's go. Do we? Make one stop down at the train He wants us to ride the fire truck. <laughs> We have to go. We have to go to Fantasyland. I'm sorry. They on the way out. Absolutely. All right. <laughs> uh, yeah, I want to go. Uh, Sarah, take me and tell me a story about Sleeping Beauty. Once upon a time. Save it. What? You have to wait. You just told me to tell you a story. Take me in there and tell me a story. Then you need to be more specific, dog. Sarah, will you take me inside the castle? You We're gonna. Me to God, jump listen. Like, Guys, we're gonna climb inside that castle. We're gonna go inside the castle. That castle right there? That one. I don't believe you. It's gonna be so magical. Are we gonna be able to look out of that window right yes. there? Yes. We're gonna that, look out that, that window. Right yes. There. And we're gonna see Maleficent. This is what I'm talking about, Sarah. Inside this castle. Look, are we gonna hear this story? Right? I already forgot the story. <laughs> Let's go inside Sleeping Beauty's I castle. Oh, well, you'll learn it again. Great. See, it's right there. Da, 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 da. Take a Aurora. Remember when we were talking about this last night and what a terrible father Aurora's father was? And the other dude, who, Prince, what's his name? He's kind of a bad guy. They're both jerks. He kind of just let the girl die. Yeah. Such an appropriate response. See, he's doing that because he was fearful of Maleficent's curse. So Stefan decreed that all the spinning wheels in his kingdom be burned. That's a lie because Stefan and Maleficent have a thing for each other. Yep. So this yep. Is See, not the that's real true. Yep. I like Maleficent's story. That is very true. So she grew up. Hey, fun fact, fresh yes. mate. You see that, like, green? Yeah. That's the only green used to represent villains in Disney films. Why is that? Ooh, it's, that's cool. It's just is. the green that they use. Like, Scar, yeah. Dr. Facilier, Maleficent. Oh, it's villain green? It's villain, villain green. green. Oh, like I gotcha. That. I want to be villain green. Let's go up these steps. Right. We're inside the castle. I feel so royal. I know. You think we can chop anyone's head off? I don't know. Oh, they changed the curse so that, that the princess Mary would Weber. not die but sleep. Mm, that's a pretty long nap. Why could they just change it to say like, she'll be fine? She'll be good, dude. She's straight. Yeah. In like, fact, she won a marathon. Totally right? awesome uh, fairy god, fairy godmothers, and we can do that. The fairies are up there. We're not the fire. I think that's pretty cool. Now, people often ask Sarah, there's a clock outside the castle and it's yeah. stuck on the same time. <coughs> and they want, I was born. They want, what's that? What? They want to know what time that represents. Uh, when she awoke? I thought it was when they put her to sleep. Oh. Like, everybody fell asleep at that time. This thing here. No, I think it's when she woke up. I think you're 100% incorrect. No, I'm pretty sure it's when she woke up. <laughs> See, pretty she's sure. sleeping. <coughs> Wake up, sleeping beauty. She just oh, slept through the whole movie, huh? It's a spell, right? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Oh, there he is. Oh. There he is, right there, just like that. Oh, God. 
He just popped up. Did he go? I was zoomed in, and he like he filled the whole frame. I didn't think he was gonna show up. Because that other guy, I've never seen that other guy before. Yeah, that's why I was like tripping out. And then this guy. There's our homie yeah. watching the castle. See, there they are. There's the demons again that she just summoned. She's a wicked one. Look at how look at how hot Maleficent is, though. <laughs> I feel like we're really going down into a dungeon right now. We really are. And then my favorite part of this is the demons coming out of her. Oh, there they are again. We were just talking about those demons. She's summoning them. She really is. By she, I mean that little piece of hotness right there. On the right. Episode. You hear that? She's got the best. Do you hear that? Oh my god. Oh, oh we just missed it. The Maleficent dragon is bringing fire down upon Prince Philip. He's trying to save Sleeping Beauty. Oh, again, we get to see it again. Reset. Can I see the button? There she is. You see her? It's dark in here, I know. Ooh, oh my goodness. Wow. That is amazing. There he goes, making the kissy boom boom. Let's see what happens. I want to make sure. Oh God, look out! <laughs> and we're making a pink or blue. Which one? Bruh, make it pink. I don't know if that's Meriwether or flora or fauna. I think it's Lushy. Yeah, a little bit. A little like bit. the other one's like make it pink. Oh, right. Make it pink. Make it pink. See, that was sweet. You're right. Right. That was sweet. <laughs> I gotta go. Make it pink. See, that's that's the clock I was talking about. It's stuck. It's stuck at like 4:05, I think, or 4 o'clock. Maybe there's a reason. Well, there is. Uh, and the, the reason is what I said. That's what time that, that I think anyway. That she put the, the fairy godmother's putting everybody to sleep inside the castle. She thinks it's the time she woke up. Some people want to say it's the time that Walt died, but he didn't <laughs> die. That's chilly. But he didn't. He didn't die at four o'clock. Some people also say Walt yeah. never died, that he was dead, right. and then he's buried somewhere. Yeah. You can't. You yeah. can't. Yeah, you can't have a time of death if you're actually still alive somewhere in you know yeah. in the Swiss Alps yeah. or something, hiding out. Frozen hyperbolic time chamber. Or That's something, right. You know? Look, it's Peter. Get him. He's fighting. He's fighting a, a handmaid. That that's a guest, right? Yeah. Oh my gosh, she's so so happy right now. Like she's so happy. You, just for for the rest of her life. You remember that time? Remember when, I got the sword when, when I sword Pan. fought did Peter Pan in Fantasyland? Oh my god. Uh, yeah, she crazy. gets to forever have like a uh, my evil queen. People. Yeah, yeah. Do you remember yeah. that time? Fresh baked, come to Disneyland and have a do you remember that time memory? Please do that. <sighs> You get, and that's the thing. You can't do that, Fresh Baked, if you're worried about whether or not you can make your fast pass at Space Mountain. When you get here, just let that kind of thing happen to you, and you'll never forget it. Better you can just use the Max Pass in life. <laughs> then you don't have to worry there about it. There you go. That one's better. Max Pass is making dreams and memories come true. Yeah. How about that? Yeah. Way to go. Way to go, Christian. You're welcome, Disney. <laughs> Where are we going? Hit it. There we go. <laughs> I got a five spot that says they're going to get on the carousel. I have no idea. You're the shot, lady. 